Hey there everybody, I'm CNY Central First Alert Meteorologist Matt Stevens. Hope this middle of the work week is treating you well. Weather-wise, we hit a high of 43 degrees at the Syracuse Hancock Airport for our Wednesday. That's pretty standard stuff for this time of the year. 42 degrees is considered a typical high at this time of the year. 32 degrees are low as of early in the evening. 24 is our typical low this time of the year. I think we're down a lot closer to, if not slightly below that typical low late tonight and into early Thursday morning. Our records are 71 and minus 6. Both of those those are safe. Our rainfall 0.04, uh, just a little bit over a trace of a, a rain at the Syracuse Hancock Airport. Snowfall wise, just about an inch picked up so far at the Syracuse Hancock Airport. That has us up just shy of 88 inches of snow for the snowfall season. How does that stack up? Well, compared to average, uh, we're a little below. We typically have about 112 inches by this time of the season. However, we're doing better than we were last year at this time. We only had 50.6 inches of snow at this time of the snowfall season, so at least we're doing better than that. Here's a fast cast to get you on through the rest of tonight and through the day Thursday. It's going to be breezy at times, quite frankly, just turning blustery overnight and colder. Temperatures drop to near 20 for an overnight low. Wind chills make it feel like the teens and even single digits at times early on our Thursday morning. A spray of lake effect snow shower hours and flurries for a pretty good chunk of the viewing area. Winds initially west, then swing around more out of the northwest overnight. West to northwest winds for our Thursday. Blustery, chilly, 29 our projected high. Of course, that by itself is below average for this time. The air factor of the wind chill feeling like the teens a good chunk of the time on Thursday. Here's our future cast. Going to pick this up at midnight, run it out through 8 o'clock in the morning, and note that we have that spray of lake effect snow and snow shower activity both east and southeast of Lake Ontario. That persists right through the the day Thursday as we currently see it blustery and chilly. I think the lake effect snow finally starts to taper Thursday evening into partly cloudy skies late Thursday night and into early Friday morning. Then hot on its heels, a new wave of energy and moisture moving in. Looks like we'll be warm enough to support a rain snow mixture by the time this arrives Friday afternoon and into Friday evening. Then we're back to being cold enough Friday night into early Saturday morning for this to be mainly cold, uh, mainly wet snow, if not just plain and simple snow into early Saturday morning. Then eventually that piece of energy and moisture as we currently see it drifts south of us by Saturday afternoon and then we're quiet thereafter on the seven day, at least for a couple of days. We'll show that to you in just a moment. Hour by hour through this evening, snow showers and flurries around breezy 30 degrees by 11 o'clock blustery overnight. Look at that down to 22 for an overnight low snow showers and flurries of broad spray of lake effect snow showers and flurries both east and southeast of Lake Ontario. Thanks to our winds west to northwest at 15 to 25 miles per hour, making those wind chills feels like the teens and even the single digits. Here's my snowfall forecast. This is a combination of both tonight and Thursday, so a 24 hour window of snowfall. Trace to three inches possible in the light blue shading, including downtown Syracuse, south of the city in the hills, also off the east end of Lake Ontario, three to five inches possible, a localized four to eight inches possible up on the tug. Hour by hour through our Thursday morning, Snow showers and flurries continue blustery. Look at that 26 by 11 o'clock, only topping out in the upper 20s, feeling more like the teens when you factor in the wind chill. Here's my seven day forecast. 19 are low for Thursday night as the lake effect snow tapers off to partly cloudy skies. Early sun, then thickening clouds Friday at 40 and rain snow mix developing in the afternoon. That hangs on as snow early Saturday, tapering off to a few breaks of sun. Breezy at a chilly 29 degrees for Saturday. Sunday, up to 32 degrees under partly sunny skies. Cl clouds thickening up Monday ahead of a new system of interest. Looks like a rain-snow mix Monday night and right through Tuesday.